Today is a very important day in our territory. In this game, these guys have to climb up and pull up the yellow cloth. Hey, look there. The first who is climbing now, I am going to marry him only. Why are you like him so much? See how he is climbing the tree. Even in his life also, he will climb oh, like that. I thought something else. Hey, Blackie. Did you get anything? Don't you know your age? Okay, leave that. There is a meaning to the way they are climbing the tree and to a life. Do you know that? Look here. You know more about the people living in this territory than me. So don't waste my time and tell me fast. Leave that. The way they are climbing the tree step by step, same way it's life. You have to pass every stage in your life and move on. Mm -hmm. You have very good space on your head. Let me make some omelette on this. And if you talk more, I will start breaking stones on your head. Mind you, I don't know from where such foolish people come. Hey, tell them to pour that yellow water. Come on, quick. Pour completely. Would you like to have a cup of tea? There is a tea shop there. Uh. Oh, he is reached soon. Uh, uh, uh. My dear ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Today we are celebrating a very important festival. A very important person from our place has just arrived. Please give him a warm welcome. His name is Mr. Sam Nicholas. He belongs to this territory and he works as a bank manager. Some more details about him. He's a great fan of English films and watches variety of English films. They are Sam Nicola's parents. Sam Nicola's is always afraid of his father. He doesn't utter a word against his father. If he says, Are you my father or am I your father? And stops the conversation between them. She is Sam Nicola's better half. I mean, wife. She is a very good-hearted lady. She always have a smiling face. She is Sam Nicola's little daughter. The cute daughter of this home. Sam Nicholas has got a son too. Come, let's see him too. Hey, Alfred George. Hey, 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 careful, careful. Yay! <laughs> uh -oh. mm. Mm. Yeah! Success! <laughs> Nobody's giving respect to me. What, Grandpa? Mm. Looks like you're in some tension. Nothing, my dear. I feel nobody's respecting you. No, no, nothing like that, my dear. Sir, uh, good that you didn't go. I thought you would have gone there. That's why I came here. <laughs> What's the matter? You should only name my son. Oh. That's why I came. <laughs> Did you see that the people of this place giving me respect? Like uh? <laughs> okay, have you come here alone? Where's your kid? He'll come now. Son, come here. Uh -huh. Huh? What do you think? Are you making me a fool? No, sir. After he was born, whenever I came here, you were not there. And whenever you were here, I was not there. Like that itself, he has grown up. We have not kept name right, that's why we call him small one. Actually, he was coming to tell that. If you sow an orange seed, how can apple come from that? Oh, uh, what orange and what apple? Just explain to me very clearly, okay? I was trying to explain to you, sir. Get lost. But now I think this is not the right time, so I'm going. That is better, you can go. You come here, my dear. Come here, come here. Mm. Show me your ear. Harry Dick, Harry Dick, Harry Dick. I don't Dick. like this name. <laughs> Godfather. Uh, this is a recent 
People tell that names should be given when the child is born itself. Okay, come from now on your I name is Shrek. I don't want name at all. Hmm. Hey, Susan, are you still not ready? Taking a lot of time. Uh, come fast. Uh, yeah, they are coming, uncle. Come fast. Coming, mom. Grandpa, why are you shouting? Ah, ah. Come quick. Sorry for the late, dear. Ah, ah. So finally the queen has arrived. Uh, it's getting please? late. Please enter the car inside. Okay. Come on, quick. Mm -hmm. Hey, try to sow the seed fast. Otherwise, it will get ripened. You need not teach me anything, sir. I know everything to do. You will get it nicely uh, from me. Get out. Hey, are you not coming? Yeah, yeah, I am coming. Just tell him. Grandpa, he's saying he cannot come. Hey, 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 what are you doing? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm coming. Hey, are you talking against me? No, actually, he Dad was trying to play. Was to are you my father or am I your father? Sit down. Things are changing upside down nowadays. <laughs> my hearty wishes to all the elders here. My blessings to all the youngsters here. Today is Nehru's birthday, also known as Children's Day. On this special occasion, I am really grateful to all these kids for having seen me as a kid too. There was a poet who actually said like this about the kids. How innocent are these blooming buds. How joyous to see their beaming smile. It's so true. A nation without children is so much similar to a desert. That's the actual fact. Children, do you know the real truth? As you grow, your problems increase. If you really mean to do something good for your school and nation, all of you should study well. Education is our sole wealth. Those who are not educated end up as a pauper. I'm really grateful to you for bearing with me. Minister Victor Lawrence has to leave law. Minister Victor Lawrence has to leave law. The order against him. Minister Victor Lawrence has to leave law. The order against him. The order against him. The order against him. Hey, please move on. The order against him. Why are you shouting at him? Those who voted for me are getting angry. It's my responsibility to reply. Yes, brother. What's your name? Albert. <laughs> Mr. Albert. I am not angry with you for having asked me to get out. But tell me the reason why. Sir, I am residing in Anthony Street. We don't have current in our area. Uh -huh. Transformer failed on 10 days back, sir. Children are having public exam. They have to study. Oh my God. There is no current. That's why at dinner they are eating at 5 o'clock, sir. We have gone and spoken to all the officials. But there is no solution at now, all. Now, Mr. Albert, what is the point in complaining to any and everyone? You could have given it to me. Sir, I came to your office and gave the complaint to your PA. Is it true? I forgot, sir. Always you forget. Uh, uh, for the mistake you have done, I am getting insulted. Now look here, how you do it and what you do, I don't care. By this evening, electricity supply should be restored in their area. Sir. Now you saw this? A good question might improve a nation. You should take photographs of people like him. For how long are you going to snap photographs of politicians and film actors and display? Mr. Albert, why not both of us post for a photograph? Hmm? Yeah, go for it. <laughs> Hey Albert, why did you come here? I asked to restore electricity in your area. Oh, these guys electrocuted you. Oh, that's okay. These guys are my fans. Why are you looking like that? Only movie stars should have fans or what? Shouldn't I maintain them? I do have, nah. <laughs> Foolish fellows. They always understand it the wrong way. Which means... I kept my hand on your shoulders, right? That's the reason why you are brought and beaten here. Now just imagine if I were shaken hands with you. They would have chopped off your hands. What if I would have hugged you? They would have killed you by now. 
sir. <laughs> get up, get up, get up. No, 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 no. I won't hug you at all. Why the hell are you thinking negative? Resignation and stuff like that. Always think positive. That's it. Very healthy for you and healthy for me. Live long. Hey. Minister, live long. Leader, live That's long. That's it. Minister, live long. This is called long. perfect brain. Keep chanting this slogan and move. Leader, live long. Minister, yeah, live Albert, long. Uh, what if somebody asks you about this wound? I met with an accident. That's what I'll tell, sir. Yeah, this is called a proper positive thinking brain. Go. Minister, live long. Leader, live long. Minister, live long. Leader, live long. Minister, live long. Leader, mm. live long. Minister, <laughs> live long. This is Leader, live long. positive thinking. Yeah, coming. Anjali, wake up and get ready fast. Why are you shouting like a rowdy? I'm coming, no? Still she is sleeping. Hmm. Hey, Anjali, why are you not waking up? Hey, you are getting late, no? Uh, where she might have gone? Without being worried about your daughter being missing, are you coolly going to school? If she is a girl, I have to get scared. But you are not hmm? that, no? Why wouldn't you say that? You are a good mom, a very good teacher, but you are still not a good wife to my father. Why, dear? Today is your wedding anniversary, right? You should have gone to the temple <laughs> and prayed. My husband itself is God. Then why should I go to temple? Mm. Okay, I kept Stephen in the hot pack. Just eat. Packed separately for the college. Here, this is your exam fees. Take care. I am leaving now. Mm. Look, mm? don't waste your time. If you go late to the college and ask fine for that, you'll get severely from me. She's really a teacher. Daily, this is the problem with you. Yesterday itself, you might have finished the homework, no? Yesterday, fully you were watching TV and now you're hurrying with your homework. Look, dear. First, feed or else scold. Don't scold while you're feeding, ma. Uh, dad, mm, mm, mm. give oh. me thousand rupees, dad. You're asking me as though you have given me money? Oh. Only if I give, I have to ask. Otherwise, uh -huh. I shouldn't ask. Who oh, is it? Don't start mourning itself, okay? Fine, just tell me why do you need thousand bucks now? Should I tell you reason for that? Hey, hey come on, come on! I just have thousand bucks with me now. Hey, I'll adjust with this. Nowadays, you're acting too smart. I know the reason. It's your grandfather. You both will nicely get it one day from me. <coughs> what <coughs> is the conversation? <laughs> Nothing, going grandpa. On? He has kept something for us. <coughs> that too, it is not for today. Some other day. Hey. Mm. Both of you. Are acting smart. <laughs> Why are you getting me to Grandpa, trouble? he's saying something. Hey, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> what, Dad? Give me your bike. Eh? Why, what happened to yours? My car is given for service. I'll be getting all in the <laughs> evening. I just want to drop your sister at the school. You collect the key from my office. Shut up, Dad. If I give my vehicle, how can I go? Hey, nowadays you're talking against me. You're going beyond your limits. I'm not accepting this nonsense. Dad, I'm telling chill, you. chill, chill. Why are you getting angry, Dad? If you get angry, it's not good for health. Over that, you don't even know how to get angry properly. If I see you getting angry, I feel like laughing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you always take your father for a ride, huh? Leave that. Uh, Have you ever been angry at me? How can I get angry on you? Actually, you're like my father. Then what about him? <laughs> Will you please leave the place? Bye, Dad. <laughs> hey, stop, 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 stop. I got the signal, you can start. Oh man, she's so fresh like she has been taken out from a fridge. Hello? I have a cell phone. Do you have a SIM card? Yeah, it's there. But it is in prison now. Why did it go there? Because of doing two murders. Whom are you talking about? Uh, I'm talking about my lover. Hey. This babe looks very posh, but after talking to her, she seems to be very local. I'll shift to other network. Brother, what are you doing down there? Hey, what's a failure? The way you're asking seems like whatever you have put, everything is snowball. True, sir. Free hit. Oh, you have been duck out for a free hit. Hmm. This number looks very fancy for our fingers. Can I take this? Sure, take, sir. It's cat for taking only. Okay, I'll take this number. But I'll give money after I put my hands on that, okay? Mm -hmm. ah, no, no, no. After I give a call. Hey, while coming, I'll take lift and come. You come directly to the theatre. Okay, buddy. What, sir? It seems like you only keep the helmet. Correct. 
taking loan for 50000 and paying emi for every month we have to put petrol and uh, pay fine for the police who catches us on the way am i a fool buy a 300 rupee helmet take lift and keep going that is what is my style seems like there is no break it's there hey uh, can you please uh, drop into surya hospital what are you thinking my friend's dad has an operation i have to go there i have to give blood um sorry happen thank you hello yeah i'm on my way i'll come in 2 minutes excuse me hmm? can you please go fast okay please go fast na hello if you go faster than this we'll have to call someone to donate blood okay, for us okay take a right we can go fast what to the right that's a one way oh, i know that i have to give blood urgently please okay <laughs> la 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 He mentioned hospital and where is he going now? You saw that? I came sharp on time. Hey, who is that? She looks very angry. <laughs> huh? Mm, It's my I new driver. driver. <laughs> <laughs> you idiot! Hey, I'll give you. Come, come. Hey, don't see her face. Hi, dear. Did you call me? I have a doubt. You are already coming in one way and the two over speed. Don't you think that's wrong? Okay, I just leave it for you. If I put a ticket, then it's five hundred. Otherwise, three hundred. What do you say, dear? Eh. <laughs> 300 is always a lucky number for me. Hey. Ah! All of you concentrate properly. If you practice all the sums it will be easy for you. Ramesh, you answer. If I give father 300, he is giving 100 rupees daily for me. In how many days he will return me? He will never return. <laughs> <laughs> Why you are laughing? Sit down. Why you stop now? Legs are paining, teacher. Let it pain. Not doing a homework is first mistake. In spite of that, you told me lies as you finished your homework and kept your book at home. One bad man is created only from his first lie. Continue your punishment. You all listen here. Oh. <laughs> Teacher, she stopped. <sighs> Come on, do it. My legs are aching, mom. It's raining, no? Do you know how painful to earn the money? Easily saying that three hundred is missing. Do you think that am I a fool? Huh? Thinking the teachers are innocent, sir? Come on, continue it. <laughs> okay, okay, enough. Hey, go to your seat. If you say lies again, no? Then I'll show you. Here, take this. <laughs> hey, she's good, good now. Hey, But she's smiling. Hey, be quiet. Now. Oh, bloody shit! What happened, sir? What should happen? The moment you open the paper, it's only nonsense news. What did I ask? And what are you talking? Why is this traffic jam? That's what I asked. Bro, minister what? is coming, bro. Oh. For one minister, we are all standing like this here. It all happens in our country itself. That too in our town. Good suggestion, but nobody listens. Dude, see that man. What is all this, sir? Sir, why the traffic has been blocked to this extent? Nothing, sir. It's all for you. For me. Why, sir? Just for one person like me, all these people have to wait or what? This happens only in our country, especially in our bloody state, and this is termed as democracy. Excuse me, everyone. This is my mistake, and I accept the responsibility. This has happened without my knowledge. Even then, since this mistake has happened for me, mm. for each and every one present here, I beg pardon from my end. Please forgive me. For heaven's sake, please forgive me. This injustice will never happen here Our anymore. Leader. Sir. Huh? Our Super, leader. Sir. Our <laughs> leader. Our leader. Salute. 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 Come on. Good man. What do? What do you say? You say the same thing. Long Our leader long live. Our leader long live. Sir. What sir? You only said we have to block the traffic whenever you travel. Yes, I did. I did say that then. Now I say it this way. Some issues may not strike even if I speak it on the podium. In this crowd, there might have been around 1,000 people. 
those people will tell it to other people whom they know and those people will actually keep multiplying it people from here keep telling people there and likewise everyone will come to know everything translates to vote <laughs> i got to become a cm right <laughs> Hello how are you hope you are fine any news i am okay only <laughs> you might all be thinking why this meeting has been convened so fast well he will be explaining that uh actually i don't know how to start uh our beloved sir has taken a hasty decision to resign from his minister's post what are you saying sir are you giving resignation you should have told you don't need the party that would have been better it's not like that then what do you mean you are the main leader of this party in your absence the entire party will get dismantled is that not true what do you say we have never opposed to whatever you have said till now right but still i feel whatever comrade has said is true compared to the past my health is not good now in addition to that the elders should leave way for the youngsters the decision that i have taken now you all should accept it since he has decided to resign from his post we have to select somebody from our group itself and that responsibility i am leaving it to him sir you and he jointly decide who should succeed me once you people are through with that decision we can call for a press conference and inform them Thank you once again to everyone. Thank, Thank you. you. I S P solemnly take oath as the 36th chief minister of the state i also promise to abide by all the rules and regulations that are laid before me and shall sir huh? the voice what you are hearing now i am also able to hear it <laughs> not only you man very soon the entire state is going to hear this uh, the time has actually arrived time might have come um but you have not achieved anything right the responsibility of selecting the new cm the leader has given to somebody else my boss and this leader are going to be relatives very soon uh -uh. in that case who will be the next minister mm -hmm. people <laughs> are always afraid of death but this man is willing to die once my boss becomes the minister for you i'll get you the same seat same minister position what uh, do you say huh, something is going to happen now <laughs> look man this is called positive thinking <laughs> i actually like you very much your name is peter robert ah robert robert <laughs> yeah. Because of this minister's support, this Paulson is doing all these illegal activities outside the city. So, whoever has come to meet Pandey has never returned alive. I'll come back. But once I come back, this Paulson won't be alive. When the minister hugs someone, this guy will kill him. Do you think I'm a dumb fellow to get killed from that guy? Brother is there? Greetings, brother. You called for me.
What man trying to show off in my area or what? Uh, that uh, nothing like that. Mm. Come here. Come here. Uh, even your guys are coming in our area. What? Your area? What man? The entire city is mine. Uh, no brother, uh, nothing. At last, uh, I have come to hear that you have become a big guy. But don't try to flex your muscles with the big guys. It won't work out here. <laughs> now we are coming to the matter. You come with a matter or what? Standing opposite me and talking itself is a mistake, and you are now talking against me. Oh, oh. For the lift. What for? That day you gave lift to me. Now I am giving you. So, everything is evened out. From now on, I won't give you lift. Even you don't have to give it. Let's stop it right here. Is it okay? Hmm? Why is that? If someone sees you sitting behind me in this bike, they'll take it wrong. If that's the case, that day I had given you a lift too. If they had seen us that day, wouldn't they have mistaken no. us? If a guy sits behind a lady, they'll think it as a lift. Instead, if a lady sits in a bike behind a guy, mm. they'll think everything other than lift. That oh. is psychology. If that's the case, mm -hmm. you can drop me next to that signal. It's okay. I'll drop you in the bus stand. No, 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 no. Drop me there itself. Okay. Mm. Oh, oh. oh people are following the rules and regulations very correctly. I'll All get down the people here are itself. behind the line. No problem, right? No, no. Nothing like that. That's what. Lift for lift. Now it's equal, right? Cool then. Hey, my key. First, pay a fine. Then I'll give you the key. Hey, hey! <laughs> so today's collection for me is from this man's hand. <laughs> what, my dear friend, did you call me? <laughs> that I will take care. You have parked your vehicle in the middle of the road. That is very wrong, you know. Okay, leave that. If the ticket is put, 500. Otherwise, 300. What do you First say? take your hand from the bike. We'll go to the side and talk. Hey, I'm a policeman. So, you're taking bribe, right? Okay, why are you shouting? Then push the bike. Oh, he is able to find my weakness. Okay, okay hold, I will hold. also help push you. It, Come on, lift, it. lift. See uh -huh. how I caught them. Go. <laughs> I've heard that guys get locked up with girls. Today I'm seeing right in front of me. Shut up and push the vehicle. Uh -huh. Not you, sir. This guy. Uh -huh. Is that Instead so? of this, you could have gone. Oh, okay, for just give a hand. Is this a Let job? us lift this. Uh, lift uh -huh. uh -huh. Okay, okay, okay. Come on, give it, give it. What? You said you'll give me. Inspector, sir. That was when the bike was in the middle of the road. Yeah. Now you brought it to the side, right? Yeah. That dude? <laughs> <laughs> you are acting mm. smart. I will not leave you. I am hey. coming now. Why is this guy running like a drunken dog? His leg is like a cutting player. Mm -hmm. If you are paying the bill, 500. Else, 300. So tell me, 500 or 300? <sighs> what? You are getting angry. So imagine how angry I would have been. Here, take it. And don't try all these tricks with me again. You understood? What? Tinkering? Looks like she's a mechanic girl. Mm, now take the money. Why, sir? Did you not see the board? No parking. <laughs> hey, uh, you get this board, you ran like a mad dog. You thought I'm a fool or what? You've kept everything ready, mate. I don't care. All that is okay. Somebody has parked in the back, right? Who has that lady? Is that so? Okay, who's that? Uh, 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 uh. Did you call me, dear? I think we are very good friends. That's why you are always coming in my life. I don't have to teach you if it is ticket is final, otherwise 300. What do you say? Come on, make it fast. <laughs> very good, girl. We have to meet very often like this. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs> ah! Whatever it is. Today we shouldn't leave. Mm -hmm. I have to prove him that I am better than him. Hey, hey, hey! What is this? They are circling us like old film villains. Hello! Why are you staring like this? I am asking you. Are you getting angry? Even we have come with loads of anger. Because of you, the money we had to give for fee, we had to pay that as fine. And yesterday, I had to pay extra fine for the electricity bill also. Do you know what my mom asked me? She asked me if I am having drinks or not. <laughs> Hello, what makes you laugh so much? 300 and 300, 600 plus 400 for me losing my pride. So totally, you owe me 1000 rupees. 1000 rupees? 
I won't leave from here without you giving me that. And then only, even you'll go from here. Why are you staring at me, huh? Say something now. Open your mouth and speak. Why are you staring like a thief? I said talk. Talk. I love you. Huh? With just one statement, you left everybody surprised. If they come to know, they will close us. Run, man. Escape. Hey, get up. Ah! Sofa is for sitting. If you want to lie down, go to your bedroom. Uh, uh, who are you? Why are you coming here? Isn't this Indran's house? You're right, but who are you? You ask him who I am. Dear, who sparked the scooter outside? May I know who you are? By the way, who are you? I am the owner of this house. I never said this is my house. What? Who are you? For what purpose have you come here? You go ask Indran who I am. Oh, How much time you are taking to bring the vegetables? Ah, who is she? You ask her. Who are you, dear? Who are you? Alfred's mom. Now say who you are. You go ask Indran who I am. What is this? Hmm? Who is who that, is dear? That? Go ask Idaya. Hey, where are you now? When will she come? When will she come? She is calm. Just come out fast. Mm. I can't handle your torture, Dad. You don't oh. allow me to take bath. After marrying, I'll go separate. <laughs> we'll think about it after the marriage. Now, just come out fast. You bloody fool. Cool, cool. Huh? Who is she? Who what? Hmm. Oh, the song I was singing. No, dear. What girl has come to see you? Girl? Looking for me? Oh, for your grandfather, you think? <coughs> hey, baby. Hey. Uh? Don't talk nonsense. First just go and see. Mm, come, come. come. Just go. move out quick. Come on. Dad, leave me. Dad. Dad. I said go. I'm coming, right? Now you tell me that you love me. Come, 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 yeah. say who is she? Come on. Come on, say who is she? Uh, wait. Who is this? This is Idea. Mm -hmm. It's not him. Indran is always very handsome uh -huh. and smartly dressed. Hello. Do you have the correct address with you? Um, number thirty-two, Kannapuram Street, isn't it? This is thirty-two Barracks Road. You have come to the wrong address and trying to act smart. Will you please go? Sorry, sorry. Such a crazy My son girl. is smart than anyone. You are not looking handsome. Hey, you are not knowing the address they are coming in. She inside. just shook us all. What? If you come to my house, do you think I'll get afraid? <laughs> I already saw that. What? Didn't you get very scared? I didn't get afraid. Okay. I could have mentioned that I know you. Okay. I thought that you're a good man. That's why I didn't if say. If you had told that I know this person, even I would have told. I would have told him that we love each other. What? Love? That's what I told yesterday. That I love you. Hey, Mister. Are you mad? Who else will love you? Ha! 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 Hmm. Your hand is very dark. Mm -hmm. Look at my hand. It's as white as milk. Then, uh, if we have kids, uh, it'll be like coffee. <laughs> hey. Ah. Ah. What is this? You don't have any other feeling. Hmm. If I have you next to me and have some other feelings, people who look at me will think something mm. else. Hmm. You talk very well. Maintain it, okay? Excuse me. Hello. Yeah, yeah. Speaking. Hey, keep it, man. Uh, I I'll talk to you later. Why do you always say Indran? Tell me what's your full name. Promise me you won't tease me. Then I'll huh? tell. Huh? It's a very funny name. What is it? Tell me. Hmm. Alfred George. Indra Devan. Wow. It's such a nice name. Are you telling truth? Then what? Huh? Who gave you this name? My dad kept it. Sure. Had I known it earlier, I would have fallen for your father. Hey. <gasps> <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Hey Nandini, <laughs> you are looking so sexy, yar. <laughs> Ask her to come the bride. Everyone are waiting for her. Yeah, coming. 
Friday is ready now. She'll okay, be coming. Okay, thank you. Till now, we have been friends in the same party. Now we are becoming relatives. I'm feeling really happy, sir. <laughs> hey, come on, yeah. Don't get ready and come yaar. fast, okay? <laughs> you're out. Uh, uh, you're out, sir. Mm. Uh, no, I left it. Marriage celebrations going on there, and you're playing here, yeah, sir. Uh. And the ham should not get the minister's post. <laughs> <laughs> I don't agree to this marriage. What are you talking? Hold on, uncle. I'll talk to her. What happened, Nandini? What's your problem? There is no problem at all. I just don't want this marriage. But why? I don't like you. That's it. What mistake have I done? Did I smoke? Did I consume alcohol? Or did I go behind any girl? What did I do? Didn't do anything till now. If you didn't do all this, what if you do all this after marriage? What do you mean? You're just not a man. You, hey! In front of me, you're hitting my daughter. Hey, you. you, if you touch my son, then I will not leave you, my dear son. I don't think she'll be a good better half for you, my dear son. She was very frank with you. She is interested in other activities. Then how can she like Hello. you? Tell me, man. Maybe she's got experience in this so-called. Hey, hey uh, mind your words. Me. Hold on, hold on. What, dude? There's a big noise in the background. It's all as per your plan, sir. They're actually fighting here. Let the line be on for some time. Let me really enjoy it. Hey, One minute. It is because of me you have grown up in politics, and you have given great respect for me. Not anymore. We don't have any relationship at all, mm. and I'm very clear about that. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Sir, I think you have ideas worked out. How did you manage, sir? <laughs> Hello, who is this? It doesn't matter who I am. I've kept a CD in your bag. CD? What CD? <laughs> yeah, what's there in it? It's the play that your dad is actually playing, not with your mom, but with some other lady. You're his daughter. If you see that, it'll be a sin. But if we show it to your mom, it'll become a big issue. If we send it to a TV channel, they will telecast it, and it'll become a big issue. What should I do? <laughs> you mean to say that in the DVD? Actually, there is nothing like that in the CD, like you're thinking. It's just an empty in CD. In that case, you will get the minister's post. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be the CM forever now. Take the seat. What, boss? Why are you getting so angry? Then what should I do? Is she a good girl? Will I not get a girl any other than this? Ah, this is the matter. There might be hundreds of girls in the town. But we have to find a very good lady for your son, so that they will get insulted. Sir, what are you looking at? The girl which I show you, if we get our son married to her, that fellow will definitely commit suicide. Do you know any such girl? I will say, but you should not get angry. Mm hmm. Sir, uh, it is our uh, Minister Victor Lawrence's daughter. Hey, what are you talking nonsense? Why are you shouting at him? I already told you, he only. Look, will you just shut up and get out from here? Sir, what Madam is telling it is correct, sir. What is correct? It is uh, even if we both are on the same party till this day we don't have a relationship at all. And one more thing, in this situation, how can I ask his daughter for my son? Sir, you don't have to ask that. Why am I here? That's alone not the sir, reason. Sir, leave all the responsibilities on me. I will take care. Sir, what are you thinking? Just say yes. Let us wait for some more okay. time. We'll think about it later. I will inform you when the time comes. Okay, sir. Then I leave. Mm. What's up, ma'am? What's the matter? Is the news positive or? Sir, definitely it'll work, sir. It should work. We should make it work. Dad. Yes, my son. You have to go alone for shopping, right? Why? If what's there wrong? There are beautiful girls around. I can't even see them properly, right? Are you joking? In your age, do you know Hello. how I was enjoying my life? Hi, uncle. Hi, baby. I've seen you before <laughs> somewhere. I had come to your house with the wrong address. You forgot me so soon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you find the actual address and the person? Yeah, found him out, uncle. Is it just a plain friendship? If it's only friendship. Girls will suffice. Why are they boys? <laughs> In that case, it should be pure Who love. Who is he? Your younger brother. <laughs> When you see me, do you think so like that? That's not the matter. Oh. Do you know you look very young. Oh, thank you, dear. Is your son already married? Oh, that need not be discussed at all. You have not given a burden to your parents, and you have selected a life partner for yourself. But see this boy? He's always behind me, just like a small <laughs> kid. This is all too much. <laughs> hey, who is that stupid driving the jeep like this, uh, man? Your wife's husband, man. I'm just coming now.
Hey, no one should go from here. What, buddy? My boss had asked your property. You could have collected money and put the signature, but you have created unnecessary problems. Now see your status. You have lost the property and your money. Huh? Okay, okay. Come out and put a signature in this. What are you thinking about? Huh? Put the signature soon. Why should we put? If say it asks us, we have to give her. We can't do that. <laughs> Hi, beautiful lady. So you are taking care of all the dealings, right? <laughs> You know something? For quite some time, my guys wanted to see you completely naked. Oh, can you come outside now? Come, come, sweetheart. Hey, come out! Hey, come out! I said come out! Hey! What happened? Suddenly, a roadblock to stop the vehicle? Hold on, let me go and see this. No! What, buddy? Trying to act smart or what? Where? Kill you! Hey! Shut him out! Hey! 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 Hey!
Hey, you should not spoke here. Go out. How many of them? Only one. Just one. Hello. How many times to tell you? You won't understand at all, huh? Hmm? Ah! Ah! Lost. Who is he? I don't know. Find out his details. Watch him properly. His end is in my hands. Where is our buddy? Hey, son of a bitch! Where are you? Just one person has hit so many of people. What the shit were you doing there? Bloody either you should have killed them or you should have died. Instead of that, just like a girl, you're sitting here alone. Are you not ashamed? You have insulted the entire group of us. Hey, hey, buddy, what happened? What happened? Why so silent? I'm asking you. Hey. Good morning, Dad. <laughs> It's Sunday. You've eaten nicely, taken bath, and again you're sleeping. You can join me and do some exercise, right? Why should I do exercise <laughs> in this age? <gasps> What are you saying, Dad? If you become little slim, I'll find a beautiful girl and get <laughs> oh, her married to you. Wow, very good, dear. You're so great. I thought great. he'll do something like that. Hey, hey, hey! I will not fall in your trap. You know who's the most beautiful girl in this world? Who? It's your mom. Oh, ho, ho, ho. <laughs> you are believing this? Why, dear? Am I not beauty? Nobody can correct you. Come on, have it. No, you give it to him. You Hello? give it to me. <laughs> If he doesn't want, hey, I will speaking. have it. I'm yeah. just joking. You don't mm -hmm. take it serious. <laughs> Dude, we can talk later. Keep the phone, man. Mm. Dad. <laughs> Who's that? Um, it was my friend. Not on the phone. Who's a girl? I'm asking. Girl. Which girl? Hey, from the day you started learning, I've told you several times to tell your name completely, and for the first time you've done it. Now tell me, what made you to tell your name completely this time? And better be frank with me, okay? Dad, keep going, Dad. Ooh, no. Uh, no, uh, she's uh, not coming. Uh, 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 Dad, hmm? why is your hand shaking like this? Uh, 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 you know, I'm just a little nervous huh? because we are going to see a girl. You're you looking know? a girl for me, not for you. Just understand, Dad. That's not the reason. She's a new girl. That's why I'm a little nervous. You're a looking girl for me. You have so much tension. What did you do when you were looking for yourself? No, no, no. I've not seen your mom before. My parents told me to get married, and I saw your mom. Anyway, your mother is very beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> How come, Dad? You are so controlled, and you have given me so much freedom. The way I want to live my life, I will make you to live like that. You are the real hero, Dad. Yes, I know, but I want to go now. But where? You. Uh, girl will come now, Dad. No, my dear. I'm getting tense. So let me go oh, and come man. fast. <laughs> Hi baby, how come you're here? Oh, I came to meet my lover, uncle. Is that so? Even my son is loving a girl. I've just come to meet her. That's the reason I've come here. Oh, is that so? Uh, All the best. Uh, okay. Uh, she talks too much. I don't know who's going to be that poor boy who's going to marry her. I have not uh -huh. told anything. You have to tell everything to dad, please. Hey. <laughs> hey, why are you sitting with this girl? Hey, you told me that day that you're loving some other boy. Not some random guy, uncle. Huh. <laughs> it's inside itself. Uh, 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 mm. This is cheating. You were talking something else that day. Eh? It was just a comedy. Oh, oh, so you were trying to pull me. No, 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 huh? no, no, I will no, not leave you today. No, uh, uh, leave him. Please don't blame him, Uncle. Oh, 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 okay, Dad, oh, oh. leave all that. <laughs> How is the girl? Is that so? <laughs> One day she took us for a ride. Now life long huh? she will take you for a ride. No, no, no I'm sorry, uncle. <laughs> I was just joking, my dear. She's asking sorry. She should be a good okay, girl. Okay, thanks, dad. Uh? Actually, why is this meeting is? You have uh? to tell this to grandpa. Uh, dad, uh, please, dad. You have to convince everyone, dad. How can I tell this to my dad? <laughs> just now I said you are a real hero. I don't uh. know how to. You want me to get beatings from my father at this age? Eh? 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 Hey <laughs> She's a beautiful girl. Dad. So I'm the caller. Come inside. Dad. I want to discuss with you some important matter. You first come and sit here. I also want to discuss one important matter with you. Actually, dad, I was about to talk hey. to
Am I your father or are you my father? I am sat here. When I tell you something now, you should not get angry at all, okay? Or Alfred is loving a girl. Why are you staring at me? No, no, no. No, no, I don't like it. Actually, today morning he came to me and told that he is in love with a girl. He wanted to discuss this matter with all of us. That's the reason he's come. I immediately said okay to him. Do you understand? Oh, you both are hmm. here only. Come, dear. What is the matter? Uncle, what does that mean? Should I tell him to go out? Uh, uh, no, Uncle. Hmm. Let him be here. Oh, uh, tell me, tell me. Uncle, you should not get angry, okay? Actually, my son is in love. Sissy, <laughs> uh, now it's like you're getting angry. That's why he is very scared to say you. He personally told only to me, Uncle. He is asking me to get permission from everyone, Uncle. So, without asking your permission, I accepted, Uncle. <laughs> everyone are here only, ah? Uh. Why? You want to discuss an important matter? Ah. Our grandson is loving a girl, right? Yeah. He told only to me, no? How you people know this? Where is that useless fellow? I want to see Come him. Let's go. I have not told to anyone. You are the first person I have told. You know why? You are the youngest girl in the house. If you tell, nobody will get angry. My sweetie, please, please do this. I will have tears of happiness. What, dear? Uh, you didn't finish that hey, story, yeah? Hey, hey. hey, escape! Stand hey, there! Hey, don't go anywhere! Hey, 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 catch him, catch him! Uh, don't catch leave him! him. Uh, catch him! Hey, don't hey. make us to run, I will not yeah? leave you today. <laughs> hey! <laughs> She is running just like a small kid. Do it carefully. All my iron clothes are full of freckles each and every time you iron them. Yeah, good comment. After coming from the school, I have to cook, I have to wash clothes and vessels. And after doing all this, you will be giving a very good okay, comment okay, for me. Okay, leave it. I had something to tell you. Shall I ask? Mm, ask. If I am in love with someone, what will you do? I will kill you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Boss, he has come to a coffee shop near ACR. Why did you want me to come immediately? What happened to you? Why are you so upset? In a house, this matter, everybody knows. Mm. And what happened? I don't know how to tell this. <sighs> hmm. They said okay. Uh. Hey, <laughs> one coke, please. <laughs> He's inside. Love me, huh? <laughs> Did you tell me this before? That is my responsibility. Why are you being worried? <laughs> now you go and start your buy. I'll pay the bill and come. So much time. Can you please smile now? There is a famous saying that goes that a good wife is a blessing for a man. But on the contrary, a good husband is a blessing for a wife is never said. Reason being, the wife plays a major role in a successful married life. Likewise, every relationship in a human being's life is actually designed by God himself. But only in the case of a wife, that is bestowed in the hands of man itself. If that one selection of man goes wrong, the entire design of God gets washed out. The bride who is going to get married loves her husband and obeys her elders and should respect one another. Only those girls can lead an exemplary life and can be an example to the entire society. My best wishes. Similarly, the men who are going to get married should also learn and respect their wives. They should also consider their opinions. Even if I am a minister, my personal minister is my wife only.
Lastly, I would like to thank everyone who has actually helped me to conduct this 101 marriages right now. Once again, my hearty wishes. Where have you brought me? Cheap point and come. Come, dear. Who is this young man? Dad, his name is Indran. We both are in love. My hearty wishes. Now look, he kept telling me that you never consent to our marriage. Now see. Why, son? Why such a distrust on me? Hello. Hello, sir. Get two garlands and give it to these young couple. On this very occasion, we can get your marriage also done. Hey, hey. no, sir. I have my mom, dad, grandpa, everyone. Ah. With their blessings, this marriage will happen. But not now, sir. Mm, not bad. You've selected a good <laughs> idea. Thanks, dad. Okay, sir. All your wishes will be done. Go sit down and witness all the other marriages. <laughs> Son. Is everything ready? Ah, ah. They are about to arrive, so everything should be okay. Everything is ready here. Okay, carry on. Hey, what are you sitting here? They are about to come. What should I do? What should you do? You have done everything, and you are asking a question, huh? Hey, Sam, what is this nonsense going on here? Usually, the bride has to go to the groom's house. Instead, now they are coming here. What For is that, happening? What will my dad do? They will come here. You ask them itself. Hmm. Oh dear, you are supporting your dad. Yes. Any problem? Mm -hmm. Hello. Hi, sir. Hello, hello. My greetings to everyone in the colony. Come. Yeah, tell me. They are here, Dad. Oh, okay, okay. Hey, come, come. Uh, come sir, come, come, come. Please, please, come. Please, please, come. Hello, ma'am. Hello, ma'am. Uh, <laughs> please, come. Please, come. Please, come. Please, come. Uh, come here. Please take your seat. Normally, the groom's people only will come to see the bride's people. You might be wondering why this change here. Not at all, sir. You are a minister. You have come personally to our house. We are really happy for that, sir. <laughs> <laughs> come. Please have a cup hey, of coffee. Sit quiet. Ah, Please thank stay. you, thank you. Thank you so much. Just keep it there. So, can we discuss what we need to discuss? What does that to talk in this? Next auspicious Muhurtam will have the yeah, marriage. Of course, uh, why not? Anjali is having huh? exams soon. After finishing her exams, we'll fix the time. Uh, before that, at least we can keep engagement. Why later? This itself we can treat as an engagement. As soon as her exams get over, we can directly get the marriage. You are absolutely right. Okay. Ah, uh, after finishing everything smoothly, we decided to go to the temple. Ah, uh, if you also join, we will be very happy. Oh, <laughs> along with us, sir. Where do we have time for all this? So please send sister alone. Uh, before marriage, we should not send like that. It is not fair exactly. What won't be right? Nowadays, everyone keep the reception before the marriage. Um, well, you can take her with you. Um, okay. Thank you so much once again. <laughs> we shall meet again. Okay. Thank, Thank you so you. much. Thank you.
morning, boss. You told me to come. What's the matter? I didn't call you to perform any rituals here. You got to kill. My ambitious political desires are going to be ruined by one fellow. I didn't get you. One fellow is loving my daughter. I know that, boss. Huh? Knowing this, you kept quiet. Shouldn't you have killed him? I thought that you know that matter, boss. In fact, I already have a problem with that bloody fellow. Now tell me, boss. I will finish him. Wait. A small correction. You leave him. Then? Finish somebody off from his family. I didn't get you. Hey, if something happens to him, people will suspect me. If somebody from his family dies, the marriage will get delayed for another one year for rites and rituals. That's enough for me. Oh my God. I don't know how can he be so cruel. I'll do as you say. Whatever happens, it should not look like a murder. It should look very realistic. Just like an accident. Sir, whatever you plan, it is always different, sir. Mm. Uh, uh, uh. One more thing. Tomorrow they are travelling to the village. Finish the job there itself. Sir, what are you thinking? Please continue the game. Hey, don't move that coin. He will lock you. What, sir? If you are supporting your grandson, then how can I win, sir? Hey, play man. Grandpa is owner, grandchild is owner. Then who is his father, I say? He is a big boss. Huh? Mom? Mother boss. Grandma? Grandmother boss. Huh? Then who is queen? Sister is the owner, is it? No, no. She is a queen boss. <laughs> mm. Then who am I? You are the relative boss. Hey! Wait, man. I loot you. Who are you, man? <laughs> I am just a boss. <coughs> Good morning, buddy. Oh, it's you. Yes, yes. She's come. When did you come, buddy? Yes, no. Has your wife come with you? No, she has not come. She is staying there. Huh? <laughs> he will not change ever in his life. What grandma? Whenever you see that grandpa, why do you feel shy? He only is my uncle's son. Uh. <laughs> what? He was pre-engaged to grandma before her marriage to grandpa? Um. Uh, In that case, how did you marry grandma? My dear boss, I will tell you the story. Okay, tell, tell. Those days, there was a tough competition among men mm -hmm. to marry a girl. First, this person was dating your grandmother. Mm -hmm. There was a bullock cart competition. He wanted that also. Uh, hmm. Then he was told to swim in the sea, uh. but he couldn't do it. Our big boss, he swam That's the sea it. and finally he got the girl out, sir. Did you cross the ocean? Uh, uh. How did you do that? Tell me, uh, grandma. Uh, uh. All this. What is this? Peanut. Oh. Everybody will correct the girls with some trick. Grandpa has done it using uh, uh, peanut. You have played some tricks and married grandma. It is not a question of tricks. Then? He uses body, but I use my brain. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <clears throat> Sister, hmm? enough of playing. Mom is calling. I didn't hear her calling me. I told you she is calling, right? Go. Hmm. I know you're lying, but I'll agree to it. But you should also support me, okay? Hey, you'll <laughs> take beatings. Go. You don't have respect for me. Hmm. Um, can we start now? Uh. Hey! Who are you? I came to catch rats here. If you catch all the rats, then the snake will bite you. Be careful. Okay, you can go. Wow! What a scene! <laughs> Big Boss, may I know what are you doing here? Huh? Where are you going? This bull's body is too hot. I thought I could just take him to a nearby cow. First you go there. Otherwise, I'll beat you. Useless fellow. What did I tell him now? Why is he getting so angry? Hey, come, come, come with me. What did you mean by that? Hmm? You asked the person who beats. <laughs> Came here with a good mood. Uncle, yeah? I have a doubt. Okay, but first you have this tender coconut. It will be very sweet. Don't miss it at all. Come on, have. Why do buffalo sit on me? What? You are cleaning your mouth with coconut water? What did you ask him and make him jog in that dress? Hmm. Why do buffaloes and cows meet? That kind of beating? I know kicking, punching, slapping. That kind of beating, I have some knowledge. Hmm. But who will beat? How will they beat? With hands or with weapons? I don't know. So you know nothing? Hold yes, this. thank you. Ah, then, if you know the answer, please SMS me. Ah, thanks. Idiot. Hi, auntie. 
Why do buffaloes and cows meet, Auntie? Uh, 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 wait, I have some work inside. I'll come huh? back. Why is nobody answering me? Hmm. Silently read the book, dear. Uh, uh, uh. Hmm. Grandpa, uh. I have a doubt. Yeah, you ask, dear. You shouldn't leave without answering my question, okay? No, no, no. You are asking this question. You don't know about his general knowledge. Uh. He finished his B.Sc. on that day, so hmm. ask whatever you want. Uh. Okay, fine. Why do cows and buffaloes meet? Uh. Huh? What the hell uh. she's asking? <laughs> that is, uh, actually, it is uh, family planning done for a bull. Uh. Oh no, this is why everybody ran away. Hey, keep those fruits properly. And then you? Coming today. Hey, we'll go today. Hey, Tomorrow we will come. come. Tomorrow? Why? Do you want me to answer to all your questions? We just want to stay here. That's it. <laughs> no, that is not the reason that actually. We will I... come tomorrow, dear. She is telling she wants to stay the... and come. Leave her. Hey, am I your father or your my father? Okay, oh, okay. God. You just come leave first. Me. Gopi. Hey, come, leave come. me. Tell come. me. You get in first. Take this and keep it in car very carefully. Aha, uh -huh. what a great treasure. What she wants me to keep it safely. She wants me to keep it safely. Hey, take the she car. Wants me to keep okay, it okay, safe. take care. Hey, open the door. Please get in fast. Hey, you didn't go ahead. Yes, yes, I'm going, going go, sir. Go. Bye, Grandma. Bye, bye Dad. Grandpa. Okay, okay, bye. Bob. Bye, uh, bye. bye. <laughs> hmm? Mm. Mm, done. Mm. Hello? Who is that? What happened? Huh? Okay, okay. I'll, I'll start immediately. Grandpa? Are you crying now? Look, son, we didn't do any sin to die like that. Hey, you should have told nothing has happened, right? Why did he allow to tell me? He cut the phone immediately. There was electricity short circuit in the house. There was a wire which burned and it fell in the house. And the house just burned completely. Okay, Grandma. When the house was on fire, where were you? The reason why we did not come here with us. In the nearby town, there's a cinema hall. A very good movie. We just went to see that. If we say that you won't leave, no, that's why we didn't tell you. That time only house got fire. Why are you still crying, my dear? Come, wipe your tears. Huh? Why are you still waiting? Huh? Come, let's continue. <laughs> Cheer up. <laughs> Come, come, please come. Welcome, Andy, sir. Hello How to are you? You, you said you will be coming to our house. He was saying so. Uh, uh. According to your status, you are not supposed to come to our place. Uh. That's the reason I myself came. I am always with him. I don't know from where he gets such type of points. <laughs> Tell me, boss. Anything important? Uh, did he not uh, tell you anything, No, sir? he didn't say anything. Uh, Mm, I'm sure he's going to get into trouble. It's like I thought. Uh, I'll tell you when we meet in person. Oh. oh. <laughs> Actually, sir wants to become a relative of you. Ah uh, ah. Uh. 
I didn't get you actually. Uh, actually, it's very difficult to understand you. Uh, uh, actually, I just want to get married your daughter to my son. God, for this you were struggling so much. <laughs> <laughs> From this moment onwards, she is not my daughter. She is your daughter-in-law. Please let us know time and place of marriage. We shall come with our daughter there. Uh, actually, you know, uh, uh, we should get your daughter's reply. <laughs> Boss, I don't understand why you ask all this. I didn't bring up my daughter like others do. She will never cross the limits I draw for. Not out of fear, but out of love. Uh, please give. <laughs> Hi, ma'am. Have it. Thank you. You also do. <laughs> Next the marriage feast uh-huh. okay. You make arrangements for the marriage. <laughs> If you visit this temple your son also will get marriage very soon. Already my son's marriage is fixed. That's why I came to give the garlands to the god. See you later. <laughs> Hey, hey. No, man. Don't come close to me. Don't come close to me. Otherwise, if somebody comes close to me, I'll slit this woman's throat. I'm seriously telling you, don't come close to me. Don't come. Mom? Hello to everyone. Greetings. Please come sir. Hello, hello. Sit, sit, sit. How is ma'am? Now there is no problem. Yes sir. We have made sure she is alive sir. This lady is safe. Now who will save you? Please take care oh. of her very well. Okay, then I shall take leave. Thank you sir. You both please be here for some time and then come. Mm. My dear, your house in your village got burned down. Someone tried to assault your mother. Some truck tried to hit your father. What do you think? What do you think is the reason for all this? Everything seems to be a bad omen. Now what you should do right now is your entire family should go to a few temples, perform some penances there. Everything will become all right. Don't delay, dear. Start as soon as possible. There everything will be arranged for you. Okay, shall I? What happened? Was there any lorry accident? Yes, but how did you know? Look here, those who are leaving now should never return. An entire family who went to visit the temple met with a road accident and died. That should be the news tomorrow. I have other plans for my daughter. Therefore kill the entire family here and don't give any excuses hereafter. Uh, uh, sir, why are you looking at the phone itself? I am still yearning to hear the news of the family who has actually gone to the temple for penance. Are you sure? Did you see them going? I saw them sir they have gone with the family. Hmm. Uh, uh. Uncle take the prasadam. What dear? Didn't you go to the temple? I said. Yes, uncle. I told all the matter to grandpa. He told the problem was not with Chenishwar. It was the Rahu Ketu who were creating problems. That's why he took us to other temple. You should have told me, right? We have people there also. Uh, your daughter and auntie, they are not at home. No. Why? Do you want to tell something to them? <sighs> no, uncle. I want to talk to you. Tell me, dear. Um. I want to talk personally. There is no problem if he sits here. You may say. Actually, 
I don't know how to tell uncle. You should not get angry. How can your words make me angry? Tell me. Let's stop this marriage. Huh? What are you trying to say? Yes, uncle. The moment we started talking about this marriage, something has been happening from that time. I think me and your daughter are not meant to be together. Huh? What if the horoscope is not good? We can do some penance for it, right? Don't talk rubbish. Huh? <laughs> that won't be nice, uncle. My family is important for me. I'll do anything for my family. Mind you, if your family is important for you, then my daughter is also important for me. That's what I'm telling, uncle. Till now, I have not told this matter to anyone. I'm telling only to you. I loved your daughter a lot. Now I'm telling I don't want. Please understand my problem, uncle. What are you trying to say now? Please, uncle. To your daughter and auntie, you have to explain everything. Hey there. Some people can be poisoned to death. Some can be killed with sweetness. This issue is settled with sweetness alone. I don't know what problem you'll get. Hmm. Tell me. Nobody has come, boss. They won't come. You come back. One more thing. Just drop this operation. Don't do anything to them. Why, boss? Suddenly. In fact. What I actually expected really happened. Boss, your problem is solved, but my account has not been closed. I'll have to kill that son of a bitch. It's my revenge. I have to do that. Don't do anything in haste. Even this fellow started talking too much. Shall I keep little more, uncle? No, no, it's more than enough. Ah, uh, 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 welcome. Come inside, uh, please. Come, madam. Please come. Hey. What you thinking in your mind? You only loved her and want to marry her, but now you are not interested to marry her. Why? We never saw your status. Also, we never cared for anything. Only for your love, he accepted everything by leaving all his status and agreed for your marriage. But you people learned him a good lesson. What happened? Tell don't me clearly. Don't just act as if you don't know anything. Because of my husband's kindness only. Still, you people are talking now. You just played in my daughter's life. Definitely, you'll face for this. After fixing the marriage, if you suddenly say no means, who will marry her? A daughter is there in your house also. Don't forget. Madam, what happened? Hey, what is going on? Yes, Dad. I don't like that girl. Are you mad? What is wrong with you? Nothing has happened, Dad. I don't like this marriage. That is what why we are asking. <laughs> hey. Uh, hey. Why are you moving? Answer to our question. The moment we started talking about this marriage, something has been happening. Our house got burnt in the village. You had an accident, knife incident with mom. Now it's all this much. If marriage happens, then what? Hey, why are you letting this? It's their marriage? dad. Something's wrong with that girl. Hey, don't talk nonsense to yourself. This is a girl's life. Please remember, you should not take hasty decisions like this. This is my life. I know what decision I have to make. Hey, why are you talking against us? Let me be very clear. That girl is our daughter-in-law. Then I can't be your son, Dad. Hey! Is that so? Then get out from this house. Why are you staring? Just get out. What are you saying? Mm. Why are you asking? Hey! To... He is now bothered about his life alone. He should not stay here anymore. Just go out. Take. Ah, uh, uncle. What happened to him? <laughs> Hello, dear. Hmm. What, Dad? <laughs> If it would have been some other girl in your place, she would have been crying. But you, you're laughing. You have the confidence that somehow I'm going to get you guys married, right? What are you saying, Dad? Us getting back together? <laughs> no, Dad. The day he denied our relationship, I've tried and gotten over him since then. 
For some odd reason, if he does this now, what if after marriage he just leaves me and goes away? How can I trust such a person, Dad? Hmm. What you said is also true. However, think once again. Thereafter, you can take a proper decision. <laughs> Why, Dad? I'm not going to change my decision. I'm ready for any other alliance. Hmm. If you're so stern on your decision, then what can I do now? But will you like the guy who I? Whatever your wish is, I'm okay with it. Hey, who's that following in front of our car? Just check. Uh, 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 uncle, save me, uncle. What here? What are you doing at this time? Good that you came here. Uncle. What happened, dear? Paulson and his men are actually looking for me. Those guys. Actually, why should they hit you? Me and him, we had a big issue. Okay. At this hour, how did you happen to come here? When I told I won't marry your daughter, my dad expelled me from the house. Oh my God! Is it so? Okay, you can stay in my guest house now. Okay. That is actually safe for you, dear. What do you say? Uh, uh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come with me. Come. Hello. First, you should be administered uh, first. Okay, sir. Is that Sam? Ah. Uh. What happened? You have not slept tonight. I am not able to sleep. Why? What's the reason behind? You just go and lie down. You will try to sleep. I try, but I am not able. You are always to... speaking against me. Are you my father or am I your father? When I was sending him, if you had asked me the same question, he would not have left this house. There, I am really worried. Where is he? What is he doing? You need not cry for this at all. If he does something, there should be a reason behind that. You just go and sleep. Hey, Uncle. You just take him, dear. Come. My dear, we both are here in this party, but I am alone drinking. What happened to you? No, sir. If they come here also, I am very scared, sir. Who? Walt Peter? Huh? <laughs> Even his father will not be able to come here. If he is Walt Peter, here there is a poison, Peter. What are you saying, sir? I will always talk the truth. You are talking about our uncle? What is this? Whatever I am talking, an echo is coming back. This brand has got a late pickup, I think. Mm? The plan has worked out very well. Everything is over now. Actually, they both have a very intimate illegal relationship. I am telling the truth. That means it's an illegal contract. <coughs> I appreciate. What should I do now? Any help? Sir, ah, uh, tell me, man. Sir, this Pan Peter had come with his men and he hit me and he has taken away the boy, sir. What are you saying? I am not feeling that he is hitting me, sir. But he has broken your photo also completely, you sir. Please disconnect the call. I'll see. Uh, okay, sir. Hey, Commissioner. Yes, sir. That Pandey fellow <laughs> is crossing the limits. It is not nice to let him go free now. Now let me start the job clearly. Ah. <laughs> What for did you break that? I had told him that they have broken his photo completely. That is the reason. Actually, he oh. deserves it. Ah. Can you just turn around? Ah. Uh, uh, hmm. uh, 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 uh. Now why did you hit me? You said you were beaten and I was taken. There should not be any confusion, right? Hold uh. this.
come, my dear buddy. I was just waiting for you. What did you think about me? You thought I'm good for nothing or what? Just count your hours, buddy. I'm going to feed you buffalo milk now. <laughs> to feed me, I have a lot of people in my house. For you. I've heard that there's no one to feed. Uh, that's why I came here to feed you. Paulson. Pa Paulson. What? Getting afraid? Already you are people who have got beaten from me. You should have asked them. Come, man. Come on, I say. brought me here to introduce you to someone very special important person who is that look there you see him it's him his name is indran he was my first lover first lover we both were in love for about a year one year but now he said he doesn't like me and he just left me like that he <laughs> left you hey hero hey. if you don't want me you thought that i would marry anybody else just look at him we are going to get married very soon You can only get half mental like this. Who is the fool here? You are the one. You are the one. You. You are the only you. one. You. You. You lose. Get lost. Shit. Hello. Why are you fighting like this? Hmm? If you both love each other, then why don't you marry her? Huh? I didn't see her face properly, and I loved her. Huh? Oh, that marriage. Go, man. <laughs> Don't tell like that, buddy. When you both were in love, I know what not would have happened. Please, why don't you marry her? That's what I'm telling. I don't like, right? You only marry her. Hello, I should marry the girl you love, da what? Oh, then even you don't like her. Uh, hmm. Then you do one thing. You tell your father that you don't like this girl. That is not possible, buddy. If you don't marry her, then I will have to marry her. Uh. Oh, then you do one thing. If you do what I say, I'll protect you from this girl easily. Hmm? The boy and the girl they don't have any problem sir. Hey Swami, did I call you here to see the match or the time? Chart me an auspicious time. Uh, no sir, actually mm. Okay sir.
Hello, boss. Hello, ma'am. For my daughter and your son, I'm looking for an auspicious time. You're seeing an auspicious time for a marriage which is over. Boss. Look, sir. If you are not interested to give your daughter to my son, miss, leave it. In spite of that. Bloody stupid fellow! What rights do you have to arrange for my daughter's wedding? Marriage for your daughter? Me? What are you saying? Uh, will I get caught now? Keeping inside the groom and the girl? Are you trying to play a game? We have already decided that we will not have any relationship at all. Now, are you trying to patch us? Ah. <laughs> yes, boss. Yes. You both were once so very close. I used to feel jealous when I look at you guys. You were more like ideal friends. But when friends like you got separated, I was deeply pained and shocked. I don't know how he is able to act so well. He should definitely be given an Oscar. Your separation was not alone a friendship, but harming our political life too. Not only that, the marriage desires of this young couple, some miscreant destroyed that too. Uh, someone? If I oh unite these guys, I was sure that you guys would join hands. I was ready to accept whatever bad name comes to me. I thought getting them married would be ideal. Huh? If you take a hasty decision, then you eventually end up with a loss. I am nobody to throw my suggestions at you. And also, you writing two separated souls is not going to make me any greater. Uh, everything has ended well. Now tell me, sir, what the hell is happening here? Sir, we should not bother about what has happened here. Now both have joined together. Tomorrow they are going to have a political meeting. They will decide about the next minister. It should not happen. We have to somehow stop it, sir. All are eagerly waiting to see the next chief minister. Oh, finally, there will not be any difference of opinion in the decision. We have decided about the next minister. There is only one man who really deserves it and he is... Just a minute, buddy. Kindly switch on the television. Without any quarrel and fight, a peaceful protest which we are conducting right now. Do you have any idea for whom I am doing this right now? For our beloved leader. Our chief minister. The leader who I was inspired by. From an academician, I became a politician. A leader of that stature, abandoning his post, bidding farewell to politics forever, is actually a very shocking news for all of us. This I could have told him personally. But till today, I have never opposed or suggested him anything. That's the reason why. I just want to bring this to your notice. He should not resign from his post. He should reconsider his decision. If he doesn't change his decision, I would continue my same protest and let you know my decision. What, sir? Why are you getting up? What else should I do, buddy? Come, let's go and meet him, sir. This is not the right time to stop his fasting, sir. People will think that you both have joined and doing a drama now. In that case, we can stop the meeting now. Okay, sir. Thank you so much to all. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Just to stop your fasting immediately, 
I have taken a decision now. The decision is already taken here. Let me share my views with you all. Please listen. I had already informed that I am going to resign my post in that meeting itself. I was firm in my decision. But who will be the next CM? That was a real confusion. But now the confusion is over. He is our next chief minister. Sir, can I talk to you for a while? Hey, leave me, man. Leave me. Don't leave let me. him ask. Yes, tell me. Sir, if Victor Lawrence sir becomes the next minister, we will be very happy, sir. For that position, after you, nobody is perfect other than him. What I am trying to say is, till the time you are alive, you be the minister. That is what everybody likes. That is why we are actually doing hunger strike. If we have to respect his decisions, you have to be the minister throughout your life. Is it okay, sir? Please say something. Oh, uh, whatever he is saying is also right, sir. <laughs> I am really proud of you. You are a very big asset to our party itself. Not only this man, I am giving respect for all of your views. I am continuing as a CM. Brother, whatever you have told, I have done it, brother. But I am very scared. Why are you getting scared? That guy's play will end now itself. Hmm. Sit behind me. So this decision has been taken unanimously. <clears throat> what uncle? You are sitting very dull? I don't know what to say uncle. From the moment I came, everything is going wrong. Whatever plans you had put to become CM, everything has gone wrong. For this I am not the reason uncle. Star's problem. Um, ah, now I will tell you what to do. Directly you go to the temple, take a dip in the holy pond and perform puja to the god, everything will be okay. Um, uncle, you go to the temple which I have told, okay? There also I have my people. Why are you staring like that? When I said I was in love with your daughter, you could have stopped. You could have told I won't give my daughter. Leaving that, you said you will give your daughter and you sent your people to kill us, huh? Do you know the reason for all your failed attempts? Love. And do you know the reason for all my successful attempts? It's the same love. That's love. You can use your brain power and you can win lot of battles. But to win love, not just you, nobody in the entire world can do that. Never. I could have married your daughter without your knowledge. I didn't do. Why? She's your daughter. You have to get her married to me. Don't lose your battle saying uh, you can't do that. <laughs> you will get her married to me. <laughs> I'll make sure you get her married to me. What uncle? You have sent some people to my house? I have invited all my relatives for my marriage. Do you know one thing? Ten people of you will kill one person. But you know one thing? Whole village is here. One guy will kill ten person. If they catch any one of your persons, they will kill their itself. Uncle, stop thinking in this alternative route. Get your daughter married to me like a gentleman. Huh? 
What you have become silent? You will get her married to me. I will make sure you do that. <laughs> what man? You also feel like laughing when you look at me. Huh? From that family you could not even touch one person. You are a rowdy and I am a politician. Not one. I have told them to fish the entire family. All she will do. Don't make me say bad words at you. Hmm. Whoever you send have been sent back to me without doing anything. Pande, he is several times stronger than you. He thinks the way like I do. It is difficult to oppose him and win, Pande. What do you mean? Should I leave him or what? No, you have to defeat him. Defeat him. Accept this challenge and we need to win. For so that you have to. You have to kill just one person. Who is that one person? I will finish him off. <laughs> My daughter Anjali. Come, buddy. Did I tell you to finish him off now itself or what? Get out! You have tried to act smart with me. I would have finished with that itself and thrown away your body. But regarding my revenge, I've got different plans now. Your death will be so cruel that nobody has ever seen their life till now. Do you know that? After death, even if you come as a ghost, you should get frightened after hearing my name! Brother, you want me, right? You just leave her. What? <laughs> Did you hear that? I've been ordered to kill your girlfriend. Why are you staring like that? The order is given by her father. You try to act smart with him. He told me all the story. If this girl is alive, then she will get married to you. That's the reason she has to be killed. And that will be his success in history. But in your case, I should finish you. That's my success. Ugh. Hey, don't leave them. Come on. Come on. Take the vehicle. Quick. Fall off. Fall off. Come on. Come on, move fast! Move the front! Come on, come on, quick! Why the hell are you going so slow? Come on, quick! Quick, guys! Come on, move on! Quick, quick!
times how many times i did not come to politics to just become an mla or a minister chief minister for that so many trials at last i thought i'll give my daughter off to km son i thought i'll effortlessly become a cm in between you came with your bloody love and stuff how can i accept this how is it possible not possible not possible stop that i wanted to kill each one person from your family that also got plot Right for you and your bloody powerful love. I wanted to defeat that. That's why I wanted my daughter to be killed. That too flop. Now, how many times should I fail like this over and over again? And both of you standing in front of me. I just have one bullet with me. If I kill either one of you, I will have won the challenge which you have thrown at me. Shoot me. Shoot me. Oh no. If once again you escape from this. Huh? She said, I'm scared if I'll get my daughter married to you or not. Who lives or who dies is not important. <laughs> who is going to win now is going to be important. Sir, we have to do something, sir. Whether I win or not, I will not let you win. Uh, I will not let you win. <laughs> Dad! You are always very different, sir. <laughs> Sam Nicholas, please forgive me. Why, Dad? Without really understanding you, I had sent you from my house. It should not have been done. I am your son, Dad. You can tell me anything. For you, I will do anything. You are everything for me. <laughs> 